So I have a Samsung Galaxy S23 and in today's tech tip I'll be showing you how to take a screenshot on this phone. So the first way is a normal Android method which is a combination of the power button plus the volume down button. So if you press these two buttons down once and release simultaneously that should take a screenshot no matter what screen you're on. So uh, power button, volume down press once and release, takes a screenshot, and as you can see, there's a screenshot toolbar at the bottom of the screen right there. Let's do that again. So, uh, power, volume down, press and release, the screen flashes, and that takes a screenshot. So from the screenshot toolbar, you can actually do things like share, edit, uh, annotate, and stuff like that. So as you can see, uh, we can edit the screenshot, you can crop, all right, you can write stuff on it like that. And then when you're done, you can tap on the save button and save. Now all screenshots will be saved in the gallery. So if you go to your gallery, there's actually a special folder for screenshots, but you can see them right in your gallery. To access the special screenshots folder, simply go to albums and then under albums, you can find screenshots and that saves all your screenshots. Now, also on this phone, you have uh, a few more ways of taking screenshots. The other way is using the palm swipe. So if you swipe your palm on the screen like that, it takes a screenshot as you can see. And this works for both directions. So if I swipe on the other side, again, that takes a screenshot as you can see, and still all these screenshots are saved in the gallery. Now, if you want to if for some reason yours doesn't work with the palm swipe, then you need to make sure it's activated in the settings. So if you go to your phone settings and then go to advanced features, tap on that, and then go to motions and gestures, tap on that, and then go to palm swipe to capture and make sure that is enabled. If it's disabled, then you'll not be able to take the palm swipe screenshots, okay? Now, there's yet another way of taking screenshots and that's using the sidebar, okay? So on your Galaxy S23, it should have a sidebar which you can call on by simply swiping like that. Now by default, the sidebar looks like this, but if you want to add this tasks sidebar which has the screenshot option that you can use to take screenshots, then you need to go into settings. Under settings, go to display. Under display, go to um, edge panels tap on that and then on the edge panel tap on panels and make sure the tasks panel is added now if you want to you can remove the original apps panel and remain with tasks or you can have both if you want to depending on what you want but let me just uh, remove apps for now and remain with tasks so now I can call on the edge panel with tasks and take a screenshot from here now one last thing is taking scrolling screenshots on the Galaxy S23 now, if you're on any scrollable page, uh, for instance, if you're on a browser, uh, which is a scrollable page, for instance, uh, if I could open Chrome, this is a page I can scroll. Now, either that on any browser or you're on a page like the settings page, which you can scroll on, then you can actually take scrolling sc screenshots. OK, so the first thing you want to do is take a normal screenshot on that scrollable page. Just take any normal screenshot so for instance i can use either this or i can use the volume down plus power button combo whichever screenshot option but once you take the screenshot as long as you're on a scrollable page you should have that option to take a scrolling screenshot now let's try that again so take a screenshot in the toolbar you should see let me just uh, make sure you're seeing that so let's take a screenshot again in the toolbar, you should see this extra option, which if you tap on, allows you to scroll and you can scroll and tap on it and keep scrolling until you get to the end of the page and that should save your scrolling screenshot. So let's do that again. Tap on that. Tap on that, that again, 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 until you get to the end of the page and then you have your scrolling screenshot. There you go. So there is our scrolling screenshot.
they're still saved in the gallery so you can access them from your gallery here's our scrolling screenshot as you can see okay now from here again you can edit you can crop out some parts that you don't want you can still annotate it if you want to and do everything you need to do with it and those are the different ways of taking screenshots on your galaxy s23 now for this tutorial we use the s23 ultra but the same instructions apply for the entire s23 lineup thanks for watching leave your comments and questions down below and good luck